Hey everybody, we're playing Pokemon. We just got the Poke Flute, and now um, we're gonna go ahead and use it on the Snorlax. So we're gonna try our best here to catch it. I know we will. I just hopefully I don't kill it accidentally. All right, the Snorlax woke up and attacked in a grumpy rage. And I know we do get a few chances to catch the Snorlax too, so not like this is the only one we get. Um, it is level 30, and also my Pidgeot is very poisoned currently. Let's see what a, just a quick attack does. Okay. I will let my Pidgeot die. It's honestly not that big of a deal. I mostly just don't don't want to kill the Snorlax. Do I die from poison here? I do. Okay. That's fine though. Um, we can go on and bring bring out Flareon here. Again, I don't care if my Pokemon die. I'm very near a Pokemon. Uh, to oh, I just need to get it to yellow, man. Oh no! I didn't realize if we didn't catch it quick enough, it ran runs away. Oh, that really sucks. Okay. Um, that's fine. We'll catch the next one. Honestly, not that big of a deal. We will just catch the next one. Yes, here's the other Snorlax. Um, let's go ahead and try this again. Um, but this time we're actually going to catch it. Um, because I'm a dummy and, um, missed it the first time. Because I did not realize that it will get ungrumpy. Let's go ahead and quick attack it. Yawn. That's fine. Quick attack it again. Used yawn. That's okay. That's good. All right. Let's go for. Oh, we're asleep. Oh, well, I can still throw pokeballs while we're asleep, so that's fine actually. Let's go ahead and use some great balls here. And fingers crossed. I don't want to lose a second Snorlax. Oh, no. Okay. Let's go and use another one. That's not good. Oh, oh no. Um, let's... Let's go ahead and just use um, an Aerial Ace here. And hope we do not... You know, let's go use Wing Attack. Oh, I'm asleep. No! Wake up! Oh, no. Dude, Pidgeot! Alright, please don't kill it. No, it healed itself. Why? Dude, no! At the worst possible moment. Alright, but should be asleep for a few turns. Alright, here's our time to catch it. It's asleep and low. I wish it was in the red. Alright, come on. Come on, please. Don't, don't let the second Srogs get away. All right, Whew. I got not. I was a little scared for a little while there. I am not gonna lie in the slightest. Very lazy, just eats and sleeps. As its rotund bulk builds, it becomes steadily more slothful. All right, Snorlax. Whew. That was um, a tiny little bit scary. So, okay, now here's where we kind of can decide what to do. We can go a few places. Um, the first thing I'm gonna do is. Um, head down to, I don't know if it's, uh, Fuchsia, but, um, I want to head down to get the Super Rod, 
So let's go ahead and go back to Lavender Town. And that way we can kind of go back through and um, go go get the Super Rod. But I also, I want to grab a few Pokemon out of my box. So we're going to go ahead and she's going to heal our Pokemon. I want to put in the Vile Plume and um, my Flareon. And grab a few other things that might be a little bit more interesting out. Alright, so which... Um, let's go ahead and deposit some Pokemon. Let's go ahead and put Vile Plume in box 5. Flareon in box 5. Um, we can go ahead and put Blastoise in box 5. We'll keep these three. Alright, we're gonna withdraw some Pokemon. Let's withdraw Ghastly. Um, maybe that's it for now. Let's go ahead and um, see what other Pokemon we can catch out in the wild. Okay, so that's all we need for now. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and grab our bike. And let's head down back Route 12, but really we're gonna go down past the Snorlax that we failed to catch and head down to Fuchsia. I think it's Fuchsia, if I remember correctly. Boom, 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 boom. Yep, so we can script through here. Go to this dude. I'm the fishing guru's younger brother. I simply love fishing and can't bear to go without. Tell me, do you like to fish? Yes. Grand, I like your style. I think we can be friends. Take this and fish, young friend. Receive Super Rod. Super Rod fishing is a way of life. It's like the finest poetry. From the seas to rivers, go out and land the big one, my friend. Now, I have a request. If you catch a big magic carp with the rod, I want to see it. As much as I love to fish, I also love seeing gigantic magic carp. Um. Okay. Alright, well now we have that super rod, so we can go ahead and kind of fish anywhere um, for a little while. I'm probably going to equip the super rod. We'll go and register that one. So now we can kind of fish and see what we get. Alright, let's see what our first Pokemon is, and I'm hoping it is... Okay, Krabby. That is a new one. Let's go ahead and grab that Krabby. Let's go ahead and use Quick Attack, and I don't think it'll kill it. Alright, good, good. Alright, he hardened. Let's go ahead and throw out a Great Ball at it. Really what I'm looking for is Staryu, though. Actually, I don't think I'll be able to get Staryu here. Um, give a... Nope. But there is another Pokemon that we can catch. Slowpoke. That's a 1% chance. Um, so that's probably not gonna happen. Alright, so we're just gonna probably be catching Krabbies here. So, let's go ahead and... Actually, stop looking. Um, we'll try to grab that Slowpoke later. So let's keep heading out for now. Hello? Electricity is my specialty. I don't know a thing about Pokemon of the Sea, though. Yeah, and I just looked it up. There's only two po two Snorlaxes. So if we fail to catch that one, that would have been kind of ripperoni for us. I'm gonna use Aerial Ace. Oh, no. Well, we'll kill it either way, so let's go ahead and just do that. My question is, where can I find... Where can I find a Staryu? Electrode? Hmm. It's gonna switch out Pokemon. Bring out Nidoking. Spark. Doesn't affect Needle King. Let's just go ahead and thrash it. Oops, Screech again. A little bit of a longer battle than I wanted, but 
Seems like I didn't have the right Pokemon to fight Electrodes. Partly because I put my Blastoise away. I want to make room for some new water Pokemon, but... The one that I want, we're not going to be able to get right as of this moment, so... Alright, I want that item, whatever it is. Let's go ahead and use Cut. Searching for a Moonstone, have you found one? Uh, yeah, actually. Alright, two Pokemon, either and male. Alright, what are we looking for here? Oh no, we got poisoned, I and I don't know if I have an antidote. Alright, so let's go and get it over with. Alright, let's aerial ace it. Horn attack. Where? Can we find a ditto here soon? That'd be pretty interesting. Alright, player defeated camp for Justin. Alright, let's go ahead and, um... We have an antidote here. Okay, I do have an antidote. I thought I, thought I usually keep everything stocked. There we go. Let's, let's also go ahead and uh, switch out Needle King to the front. Needle King will be able to take care of most of these Pokemon. Found one iron. Ooh, you never know what you could catch. Yeah, that's facts. Alright, another fisherman. Sent out Magikarp. Good thing it's not a Gyarados. I'm right, about to send out another Magikarp. Alright. Here we go. Alright, Beauty Fisherman Andrew. We got a little uh, body of grass. I think we can find a new Pokemon here, I'm pretty sure. Let's go ahead and see what we can find. I'll probably just sit here until we find something new. Ah, there we go. There's something new. A Venonat. Alright, let's go ahead and try to cut it. Hopefully not kill it. Alright, use Confusion. Critical. And super effective, and it still didn't do anything. Right, let's chuck a great ball at its head. I think we should be able to get it here. And then I know there is a ditto that we could catch coming up. I don't know if we can find it in this patch. Lives in the shadows of tall trees where it eats bugs. It is attracted by light at night. Um, but I know we could find a ditto for sure in the next area, so we're just gonna go ahead and keep moving on here. Alright, well I have to fight. I found Car Carbos in a cave once while I was splunking. I do have to fight every single person, so it's a little annoying, but I will go ahead and fight these people. This is gonna take a tiny little while, but... I'm gonna just use Thrash here. About to use Poliwag. Let's go ahead and switch out to my champ here. I think my champ could do some work. Oh, we'll leave my champ in for a little while longer. Oh, I keep getting these notifications for a game on my phone. I'm going to just un uninstall the game. Um, where is the game? I don't even know. 
At level 35. Alright, Alma. Thanks for your money. My bird Pokemon wants to battle with you. Your bird Pokemon. Bird Keeper Sebastian. Alright, let's go into Rock Slide. Ooh, quick attack. And the crit. Yeah. And then he's gonna set out his Pidgeotto. Which is gonna have probably the same fate here. Yep. This one was not smart enough to just use a quick attack though. Alright, Sebastian. Oh, you juked me. Hold on, good for a kid. Alright, let's see. Well, I've got five Pokemon, so that's a pretty good start. I wonder if, uh, if a cut will kill it. <laughs> it got poisoned, lol. Even a cut will kill it. Okay. Now. Thirty-nine. Yeah, this this picnicker has all of the small Pokemon. Pidgey, Raditum, Meowths. Come on, man! You're not gonna evolve a single one of them. And yeah, a Pikachu. I wonder what the fifth is. Oh no! Paralyze me. Oh, and another meow. What well, kind of sucks? Well, good thing I have some paralyzed heals, so that's fine. All right, we defeated defeated Susie. But well, we got. Let's go ahead and get out a paralyzed heal. Keep going. All right, so now we got some more battles. So let's go ahead and wow, your badges are too cool. Let's start uh, running through them. Yeah, today's not gonna be a super exciting episode. It's really just we gotta go down a couple of routes and defeat some people. So let's go ahead and do that. So it's gonna take a little while, but these Pokemon are a little stronger than normal. This is that Poliwag's level 30. Which is one of the highest that we've seen thus far. That's good. It means we're going to a, a little bit of the harder places, and we're still, like, you know, 10 above it, which is pretty nuts, but. I know the next couple episodes are probably going to be exciting because we're going to the Safari Zone, which is always a super good time. My cute Pokemon wish to make your acquaintance. Alright. Sounds like a plan.
All right, guys, sorry, I just had to answer some texts, but look, we got some 43, and Nita King is trying to learn Megahorn. I think this is a good move. So, let's go ahead and delete a move to make room for Megahorn, yes. It's a bug move, but it's 120. Oh, wow. Um... I'm thinking we should probably get rid of Double Kick. Yeah, it's going to get rid of Double Kick. I know it's the only fighting move, but Double Kick just hasn't actually worked that well as a recent. I think Megahorn is a pretty good addition. So let's go ahead and do that. And then there's a little grass patch here. Ooh, a lot more trainers. Why is there so many trainers, dude? Oh no, there's so much fighting to do. I don't have, like, any PP left. But I think this is all of the trainers for a while, right? Because if we basically come over here... Okay. Um... Can we somehow slip into... Slip into, a uh, Fuchsia just to heal? Because I don't have any PP left on Nido King. Yeah, like, I literally don't have any PP left. Let's try to maybe sneak in. And we could also grab something very important. And maybe we could also find a ditto, maybe? Maybe? Alright, let's sneak inside of here. And we get a really good item from this guy, if I'm correct. Hi, remember me? I'm one of the aides. If we have more than species, I'll give you a more than 50, I'll give you a reward. Yes, I yes, I have. Great, you have caught 60. Here you go. We received the XP share. This is gigantic. Um, so we can give this to a Pokemon, and obviously it'll get XP as we fight. Um, so right now, do we have anyone to give it to? Oh, we should probably give it to Ghastly, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and just for now we can go ahead and give it to Ghastly. Where is the XP share? Oh, it's probably down here, isn't it? Alright. You get the XP share. And we'll probably give it to someone later on, but for now, let's just go ahead and give it to Ghastly. Um, so we're gonna sneak into town, just but just to heal. Um, oh. Okay, yeah, I was like, do I have another route? Um, but I do not want to actually do anything here. We will check out this town in the next episode. We have to go back to the route, and we have to finish the route. I want to go finish all of the battles and all that good stuff. Let's go see if we can find anything in this um, little patch up here. I think it's going to be probably the same Pokemon, you know. Oh, here we go. That's the one I'm looking for. Ditto. Alright, let's go ahead and, um... I don't think a cut will kill it. Psych! Yeah, well, let's go look for another one. Alright, here we go. Another ditto. Let's go ahead and actually try to catch this one. Maybe without killing it? Um, let's just chuck a ball at it and maybe see what happens. Okay, that didn't work very well. Alright, transformed into me. Let's just throw another great ball. I'm just hoping maybe we can get lucky here. Okay. Rock slide. Alright, let's just use another cut. Let's see if it kills it. Okay, it didn't. Let's just hope for not a crit. Okay. Alright, thrash me. Oh, now we should be able to catch it pretty easily now. All considering. Whoa! What? Really? Oh, don't hurt yourself. Don't, don't hurt yourself. Dude, if it hurts itself, it's gonna die. Why, dude? Alright, alright. It's gonna catch here. It's gonna catch here. Whoa. 
Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, that's fine. Yeah, like, I'd rather you hurt me. I'd rather you hurt me than kill yourself here. Dude, wow, the Ditto's causing a lot more trouble than I thought it would. Oh, it's gonna kill Manita King. Dude, I've already used like six balls on this. Dude, this is Nick. This Ditto's nuts. Wow, dude. What in the world? No! Oh, that made me very angry. I swear, this diddle's gonna be the end of me. Oh, we almost killed it. All right, a little lucky, a little lucky. But I'm running out of great balls here, man. I'm, I'm using all of my great balls on this one stupid ditto. Dude. Wow. Dude, what's with dittos? What is what is this catch rate? Okay. <laughs> wow, dude. The catch rate on one of these is nuts. Capable of copying any opponent's genetic code to instantly transform itself into a duplicate of the enemy. Alright guys, we're ending this episode here. We're gonna fight the rest of these trainers next episode, man.